All right. Here we got. Here we got Mega Man 3 for the NES. This is just going to be the regular old game. Let's see what it says. Mega Man 3 explodes in the back-to-back -back robot battle. It's a robot rebellion and nobody's safe, at least least of all Mega Man. This time the super powerful cyborg takes on a horde of metal maniacs who've had it with being obedient and they use every android annihilator ever invented to make you believe it. Mega Man goes berserk, blasting through a galaxy of mining stations in search of energy crystals. But it takes more than guts to battle the phenomenal robot masters. I always like wonder, like who wrote who wrote the back of the box? <laughs> Twenty-one rapid fire levels. Fight all new, totally terrifying foes. Call Rush, your dog droid, aw, for super machines that speed you past danger and demolish, uh, and then demolish master robots and gain their powers for the final cataclysmic clash with Dr. Wily. All right, it's gonna be Mega Man 3, folks. Because why not? It's been a long time since we played Mega Man 3. I actually think it's been about four or five years since I played Mega Man 3 on stream. So, long time overdue for, for, a, for a new uh, to play again. What's up, John? Hey, Kayla, Gannon, New Bowler, Anthony Hoffman, John Haynes, Shawner75, Civ79, Cinemasker Fan, Dong Saucer. What's up, Brutal But Clean? What would Fexana do? That's a good name. <laughs> Thanks for the Bugs Bunny cheer. All right, we're gonna get this going. Cowabunga, Mega Mike. What's up, Witch Knight? All right, we're back in the action with Mega Man 3. Let's start the game. Bum 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 bum. Tis Dog says that this is his favorite Mega Man game. Bum 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 bum. Have I played Bio Metal for NES? Uh, not sure about Bio Metal for NES. Uh, what did you say? NES Super Nintendo. Uh, not sure. I'd have to look that one up. That one does not ring a bell. With all those EverDrive streams I've done, I've uh, played a lot of stuff now, but... <laughs> Excuse me. Oh my god. Why is Mario Brothers so slippery? Why is Mario Brothers so slippery? Uh, I don't know, what, what have you been doing with your, with your cartridges? Sticking them, sticking them in the butter in your refrigerator? Like, I don't know what to tell you. Didn't expect to get that question as soon as I started streaming Mega Man 3. <laughs> Thanks, Wilson, Kurt, Jack. Mario's always sliding around in all of his games. I mean, on the ice levels. How about, how about Mega Man? He's sliding around right here. Look at this. Oh, 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 here we go. You like how Proto Man shoots over me? Yeah, he's he's not. He's he's a good guy, that Proto Man. This song reminds you of a Genesis song? What Genesis song? Can you think of it? Hoping to see me play Guardian Legend sometime? One day. One day. Is Mega Man a whiskey or rum drinker? Um, well, he's a, like a robot, so doesn't, wouldn't he drink like oil? Really? <laughs> he drinks like gasoline. Mega Man's hardcore, he's just out there drinking gasoline. <laughs> this, oh fuck. <sighs> Damn it. I'll get it, I'll get it. There you go. All right, next. All right, so you do this, that, that.
There we go. All right, first try. What's up, Nikki Fog? Thanks for coming in. Hey, Shintario84. Top 10 boingers? Top 10 boingers? Boing! <laughs> Mega Man 3. Those E-tanks are really just all kegs. You know, they, they might be, they could be kegs of gasoline or oil too. Since that's, since he's a robot, let's not forget that he's a robot. All right, anyway, so, um, yeah, like I was saying, it's been three years, four, three or four, I think it's actually been four years since I played this on stream. So it's been a while. Mega Man 3 is a classic. It's one of the best Mega Man games, really. Maybe even the best. Fight Magnum Man here. Damn it. There he goes. Thank you, Master Sun Gaming, for subbing with Twitch Prime and Phidias McCormick. Appreciate that. is highly underrated. I have to do that too. Four is underrated? I like four. It's good. After the slide was added, there was no going back. Well, the side, slide is great. I like in the uh, that fan Mega Man game I was playing, Rock and Roll, had a, how Roll had the double jump. Mega Man 9 is meh. I liked Mega Man 9. I like. I actually, I, I like those ones. Um, let's see. Oh my god, uh... Isn't five fairly rare? Yeah, a bit, from what I know, yeah. You can get these guys off the screen doing that, it's a little trick. Hey, creep fighter. Play Super Mario 2 Advance on GameCube with the shitty controls. Super Mario Advance 2, is that the is that Mario 2? I always forget because that's so confusing. Which which Mario game is that? Rush Coil? Yeah. Boing. There's your boing. I'll give you a boing. Advance 2 is Super Mario World. Okay, so you want me to play Super Mario World on the game... on... Wait a second, they have Mario World on Game Boy Advance? that you can play on a Game Boy player? Really, really Mario World on Game Boy Advance? I don't, I don't think I even remember that. I wanna see that really quickly. Which one's that, Super Mario Advance 2? Oh yeah, Super Mario World, Super Mario Advance 2. What does that look like on Game Boy Advance? That's pretty similar, I guess. But you, so you want me to play that on GameCube with shitty controls? So you just want to like, you just want me to like, you want to ruin Super Mario World for me, basically. See, I had Super Mario Brothers 2 on Game Boy Advance, uh, whichever, whatever they call it on Game Boy Advance, that's the one I had. I know that Fire Marshal Bill from In Living Color is in the movie called Liar Liar when Jim Carrey is at the ambulance. Um, I didn't know that. 
But, uh... <laughs> um... That's good, that's good knowledge to know. Uh, it's very important. It's, it's especially relevant to Mega Man 3. I used to watch a lot of In Living Color. I liked In Living Color a lot. Um, I really, I really like Damon Wayans a lot. He's like my hero. <laughs> um, back then, <laughs> at least when the show was on. Um, yeah, I was, a, I was a big In Living Color fan. I used to watch it all the time. But uh, I did not realize that Fire Marshal Bill was. In Liar Liar. Thank you. Uh, I will have to go watch Liar Liar and look out for that. <laughs> he wasn't in Liar Liar. Another, somebody now is saying he's not in Liar Liar. So we're gonna have to figure this out. Um, <laughs> Al Raz goes, <clears throat> hard man, <clears throat> hard man. That's false, he was not in Liar Liar, says Master Shake. So why is he telling me? You're just you're just trying to troll me to tell me that fucking, that he's in there because Jim Carrey's in the movie? Like, why, 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 why troll somebody for that? <laughs> Just, well, you got me to talk about it, so I guess that's why. <laughs> I haven't seen Liar Liar since it came out, so I don't barely remember the movie. Jim Carrey was Fire Marshal Bill, so that's why. He said it. I know Jim Carrey was Fire Marshal Bill. I just said it. I used to watch In Living Color all the time. That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying why why bother to <laughs> do that? Alright, let's Magnet Man? Yeah, Magnet Man, motherfucker. Do Thank you, Kayla Kilgannon, for subbing with tier one sub. Thank you very much. More like easy, man. You could say that guy that was lying, lying. All right, top man. Thank you, Kayla Kill Gannon. <clears throat> Hard knuckle. <laughs> you said hard. Mike plays Mega Man 3 in the wrong order. That's it, that's it. Is that like a challenge idea? Alraz says that this is the best song. Thank you for that. It's a good pick for a good song. Yeah, it's a good song. It's a classic. Definitely memorable. Top man's weapon is useless and hard to use. Um, it is, uh, spoiler alert, what what kills the last thing in the game, so it's not totally useless for sure. Do -do. Should I go get that? Should I go get it? I think I'm gonna go get it. I'm gonna be Mr. Cool, cool Pants. <laughs> go get it, fucking shit. Oh no, no, no. Mr. Cool Pants. There we go. You can beat the final boss with top spin, by the way. That's, I just said that. Ah, uh, but the chat's delayed, so that's what happens. Button. 
Button, button, who's got the button? Push the anti button. Somebody's asking me to do my inspector gadget, so there you go. On your remote. See, I, I aim to please. You ask, I give. Punish that pussy. It's my specialty. Say, look how fucking fast I punched that pussy. <laughs> you inspected her gadget? Oh no. Da -da 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 -da. Inspect her gadget. What do we like? This is now in the last four seconds become literally second grade. We, we're, we have now all reverted back to second grade. I guess we have. We're playing Mega Man 3, so. about right all right top man time uh, come on fuck you spinning around like he's at the roller skating rink Look at him. Is he on roller skates? I think he's on roller skates. Doing the hokey pokey. You turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Mega Man is cock man in Japan. No, I believe he is, um... Well, you know what? If you want to call him cock man, you can call him cock man. You call him what you want. So, top man just got fisted. It's very mature. This is a very mature stream. Mike, this is second grade. It's, 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 I think so. I think you're right. <laughs> do, 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 do. Roller skates, it was the 80s. Which is my most hated boss fight on Mega Man? Uh, you mean Mega Man 1? You know what I'm about? Um, or any Mega Man. Mega Man 1, uh, uh... I don't know, like, as long as you have the right items, you're usually pretty good. I actually kind of like fighting the, the Yellow Devil, so not, not him, um... I got a good answer for you. How about, you know what I don't like in, uh, oh no, I mean, I I thought of it. Uh, in Mega Man 2, the, the fucking thing where you gotta bomb the walls, I hate that. And I also don't like the, uh, that fucking dragon. I mean, I know you just, you, you turn pink or whatever and then you shoot the boomerangs at it, but that dragon, uh, if it gets you the wrong way, you'll, you can like fall off the like little platforms in Mega Man 2. That, that, that's actually kind of annoying too. Because it's just like a kind of cheap. You can just fall off the little, you know, platforms. I don't know. That's the stuff that came to mind. But I mean, the stuff I really don't like probably more like something in like Mega Man like five, I would imagine. Because it's like I remember those bosses just sucking. So that's another thing. I mean, I don't know if you were talking about just bosses that I think kind of boss fights that I think kind of suck. Um, as opposed to ones I don't, you know, whatever. Um, so, I don't know. I think, I think the bosses in Mega Man 5 kind of suck. Do I usually do the pause strat on the yellow devil? Um, yeah, I usually do, but, uh, I, ha I have played the game on stream, and you can watch the video. If there's a mod, somebody can link it. I have beaten the yellow devil without um, using the pause trick, but I usually do because it's like, you can, it's like, why not? Um, but I am capable of doing it without it. It's just more of a pain in the ass. How did you meet Tony? He is awesome. Uh, I hired him years back to be an editor for Cinemassacre. Uh, 
so I gotta do still just do top men on shadow man I suppose we'll see let's see if this works talking about top man being useless it is it is hard to pull off but look at all the energy it took away I see you're playing that good shit what's up burgundy one two one thanks for coming in Da -da -da. Top spin is top notch. Thank you very much, Lucas Exemplar, for subbing tier one for 12 months for a year. You should have a new Pac-Man thing now, I think. Loyalty badge or whatever. I think so. Da -da 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 Thank you, Last Mage on Earth, also for the sub. Who gets more pussy, Mega Man or Link? Um, who do you think, Manny? John Haynes says Link never got shit. Yeah, you know, um, Princess Zelda is very, you know, I don't think I don't think Zelda likes Link. <laughs> I've gotten the impression. Actually, if you watch. Um, the Zelda cartoon. She definitely doesn't. She's like, just very, she does not like him. And he, you know, he's constantly saving her life. It's, it's a little, uh, it's a little rude. How rude. That's probably why he's so pissed off. Excuse me. I mean, you can really like him with that catchphrase. Mega Man bangs roll. Says creep fighter. Okay. <laughs> I think my chat's going for Mega Man to answer your question. <laughs> Thank you, New Wave Junkie, for the Twitch Prime sub. Rock and roll. I like the episode where she got webbed up by spiders because she sh finally shut the fuck up. I mean, honestly, she was, very, on that show at least, she was very mean-spirited, usually, towards Link, and he's like saving, going out and risking his life and saving her continually. It's actually, um, you know, it's kind of crappy of her on that. But in the games, I think she's, she's fine in the games, but, um, yeah. I don't know, maybe that cartoon did kind of suck. <laughs> Link plays with his master sword. Mega Mike. She wanted that white knight. Yeah, that episode. That's a good episode of the show. I think that's in one of the comics, too. The White Knight thing. The Valiant comics from back in the day. Which I, did, I did a blog post on that on my blog. What's worse, What's the worst quote you heard from the Zelda cartoon? Uh, it, you know, it's been a while since I watched it. So, I mean, the one that, you know, comes to the top of my head is the Excuse Me Princess. But, um, fuck. Saw that coming. Um... Oh, I should have, should have had it on like shadow there or something, right? Uh, I don't remember the other bad quotes from the show, but I'm sure there's a lot. Clean the floor with your tongue. Sounds like Ganon. Didn't Ganon say that? <laughs> I think I remember that. Alright, we're gonna do... Shadow. Fucking get it. There. There you go. Shadow Blade wishes it was Metal Blade.
Alright. Oops. There are two CDI games that has Zelda playable. Yes. We were talking about the CDI games yesterday in the Mario stream. Weird that there's so many Homebrew Mega Man games, but there's no Double Dragon Homebrew. There's got to be some kind of Double Dragon Homebrew, I would think. Maybe that's probably harder to make. Does anybody ever try to beat the boss as close to the middle room as possible? <laughs> to try to, so at the end when you warp out, you warp out in the middle? <laughs> I used to do that as, as a kid. Uh, <laughs> is that like an obsessive compulsive disorder thing? Because <laughs> I used to do that. So, so me, to answer your question, uh, was that nostalgia factor? <laughs> I'm the one who did it. Snake Trouser Man. Snake Trouser Man is one of the classic uh, Mega Man characters. One of the one of the best too. He's really tough to beat though. It takes a while to beat him. Playing Mega Man games, they're just not always trying to end up in the middle of the room to warp straight up with little to no movement. LOL. Yeah, I, yeah, I do the same thing. <laughs> I don't. I mean, I don't think I really do it anymore, but I used to do that. <laughs> it's really funny. Think that's the, that's like things only our generation really remembers doing. You know. <laughs> Say that to a, you know, 10 year old today, they'll be like, what are you, what are you talking about? <laughs> Which Knight says, Snake Trouser Man and Hard Man are two of Zelda's favorites. <laughs> are they? Mike, how old are you? Says Ever Brooklyn, if you don't mind. Um, I am 54. I'm, I'm, I'm 54, and I'll be uh, 55 uh, next week. Actually, my birthday is next week. I'm turning 55. I have my driver's license now, so watch out. Oh, there you go. She just says 69. Damn it. Wow, happy birthday. <laughs> Alright, um, let's rush marine, rush coil. I could probably make this anyway, but... Boing. Boing. You're watching on a smart TV. Watching Maxwell Smart. How old is James right now? James is, uh, just had his 23rd birthday. James is 23. Is the volume low? I can turn the volume up more. Well, my volume up. I'll try to turn it up a little bit. There, I just turned everything up a little bit. Hopefully that's better for you, I don't know. 
If the volume ever is like, you know, too high or too low, let me know. Uh, Aaron and I did a stream the other day of Gauntlet Dark Legacy, and I think the first like 20, 30 minutes of it, we had the volume up a little too high and you couldn't even hear us, so. So if, it, if, it, if it's ever like that, please let me know. What's up, Anti Doom? Welcome back. One, two lives left here. Thank you, Vertical Bacon Sandwich, for the tier one sub. Just in time for some Mike Matei Live. It's Friday night for you. Vertical bacon sandwich. Why is it not a horizontal bacon sandwich? I want to ask you. That is my question for you, vertical bacon sandwich. Why vertical as opposed to horizontal? Did I know this game isn't even finished? There was a whole storyline that never got a chance to be done. They, they should, somebody should go back and add that in, whatever it is. That'd be a cool idea for maybe a hack or mod or something. Mega Man 3 Complete, perhaps they could call it or something. The Complete Story. There's already a hack like that? Bye. <laughs> uh, there's already a hack like that? Bye. And then he leaves. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Fucking goddammit. What's the best game of the 2010s? Is Goat Simulator. Uh, the 2010s? Arkham City come out. <laughs> trouble making a buy this part. Thank you, Anti Doom, for that sub. Twenty ten, half the fork knife. Black Tiger. There you go. That was it. Arkham was 09. Ah. Street Fighter 2010. That's what I should have said. That's what I should have said. Hyper Light Drifter. Hyper Light Drifter is cool. I'm not, I want to. I'd like to stream that whole game sometime, someday. So. Is there anybody better to actually use on him? I don't even know. Isn't isn't he like one of the like use Snake Man on Snake Man kind of guy? I think. 
like later on in the game. There you go. Needle? Oh. She used a needle on him. That one I didn't remember. Any other first person shooter plans, Mike? Uh, I'm sure. Um, I mean, going back to Doom, there's. I want to do like the final Doom stuff and the Plut Plut Plutonia experiment. Plutonia experiment, whatever the fuck that's called. Plutonia experiment. Uh, I think it's. I think that's it. Anyway, final Doom. Um, I wanted to play like Halo 3 sometime. I, I mean, I guess that's not. If you want to do like third person stuff. Have I played Axiom Verge? Yes, I many, many years ago. That was the first video I ever did with Ryan, like a long, long, long time ago. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. Have I played Doom Master Levels? Um, nah, it doesn't ring a bell. I don't think so. Did I enjoy Halo? I haven't watched that stream since Master Jake. Um, when I first started playing, I was playing Halo 4, and when I first started playing it, uh, I wasn't really into it. And then as the game went on, I, I started liking it a lot more. So like by like the end of the stream, I was like really enjoying it. Um, I think I just didn't like the like how the game started. Uh, but yeah, it definitely got like better later. But that was that was just the fourth Halo. Um, the uh, you know, so I'm only speaking on that one. I, I want to play Halo 3. So one of, one of these days I'll do that on stream. Um, gross, your first Halo was 4, what the fuck? No, my first on stream. When the original Halo came out, the Halo 1 on Xbox, I played it like whenever that was in 2000 and whatever before like streaming existed and I played probably halfway through Halo 2 I think back then and I think that had a, like a multiplayer that I would play with people but but uh, Halo 3 I never did play he says oh okay see people jump to fucking conclusions so fast they think they think one thing when it's really the other. Thank you, Z-Man One Thousand, for that. Quake when? When people shut up about it for like two years. When I hear no comments about it, that's when. <laughs> so. Let the games begin. See if somebody mentions it tomorrow. Actually, so I, I actually have streamed Quake, uh, Quake Live. I'll stream Quake at some point. I don't know. Quake Live is pretty fun, though. As a relative of Ace Duck. It's Ace Duck's father right there. There's and this is his mother. And I just murdered them both. Sorry, Ace Duck. Not really. Welcome to Mike Plays Angry Birds. What a mother ducker. <laughs> yeah. Look at him go, look at him go! Oh boy! Huh. Give me 
that. Give me that. To be honest with you, all I play off stream is Bejeweled. Just, you know, I do man, three hours or so of streaming a day, two, three hours, something like that. And then the other like seven, eight, nine hours, Bejeweled with, with only a couple bathroom breaks in between. Candy Crush, a little bit of Candy Crush too. All right, how many? Pause it, fuck. Okay, I do have two lives. Alright, I'll let him just kill me. Alright, um. Let's try Snake. What other mobile games do I play? Uh, I really enjoy My Horse Prince. That's one of my favorites. Um, besides that, uh, that's really it. My horse prints, and um, well, there's probably something else. I like Ski Free quite a bit. Not mobile, but just in general. The flying toasters are good. Gemini Man was your favorite growing up. Oh yes, Raid Shadow Legends. I love Raid Sh 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 Shadow Legends. You're playing Donkey, the Bill Gates game? <laughs> Jeez, excuse me. But first, a word from our sponsors. <laughs> you know, I used to, you know, growing up, I watched a lot of, like David Letterman and you know, Johnny Carson and that kind of stuff. Um, and I remember see seeing Johnny Carson, and he, you know, he would just be like, uh, he'd, he'd you know take like I don't know, fucking like soap or something, and he'd be like, you know. New Dove, like, like, and it's just, or whatever, you know, stupid product, and you know, like, Johnny Carson didn't fucking give a shit about any of that. You know, brand deals have been around forever. We wouldn't be able to do all this stuff. But you know what, that's kind of cool, what's cool about Twitch, is you guys can just directly sub and donate here, and then you don't have to be like, you know, boy, I really like, um... Hmm. Uh, I, I really like uh, downy fabric softener or whatever. That's my favorite thing. That's what sucks about YouTube. But, yeah, YouTube's a shit show. Dr. Pibb. But you came here for the ads? Uh, okay. Uh, let's, let me give you an ad. What can I give you an ad for? Oh, I'm gonna give you an ad. Buy the new issue of Nintendo Power. On sale in 1989. This is all about Ninja Gaiden 2. Buy it now. US 350, Canada 450. Sorry, Canada. There's, there's your ad. I'm just gonna do, I'm just gonna do product placements for things that aren't products anymore. Wait, I, I'll give you, I'll give you a product placement. Do you like video games? Do you like quality video games? Well, are you, do you consider yourself a hardcore gamer? I bet you do. 
Well, you should play Dead or Alive 3 for hardcore gamers only. Available now on PS4 or PS Vita. <laughs> Trouser Man approves, by the way. By the way, uh, who, who made that? Who made, who made this fucking thing? I don't know, it's on PlayStation. Tecmo. Tecmo, uh, I, I'd like my check in the mail. PayPal, whatever. Send me the money. I need another copy of Little Samson in the box. <laughs> when a new fun fucko land? Well, uh, we shot one just the other day, so it has to be edited and whatever. So, somewhat soonish. I don't know. In the next couple weeks, probably. For hardcore porno fans only. Uh, retail reviews for hardcore porno fans only. That's what I was talking about. Do you own any Fucko Land stock? It's my store. What are you talking about? I own it all. I own everything. Every fucking thing. The, the bricks that built the building. When you walk up on the sidewalk, it's my fucking sidewalk. So if you shit or piss on it, you better watch out. <laughs> because, I'll tell you why, if you're gonna shit and piss at Fucko Land, you're supposed to come through the door, then ask politely and say, Mike, where's the bathroom? Don't expect me to be there, by the way, because I'm, I'm not there. Um, say, Mike, where's the bathroom? And I'll say, we don't have a bathroom. Shit on the floor. And then you'll be like, and then you'll look down and you'll see a giant pile of solidified Tyrannosaurus shit. And that's where you go to the bathroom. Not on the sidewalk outside, please. That's where we have our collection box. It's a good store. Um, what are we doing here? Let's try this thingy. I don't know. Boing. 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 Bum, 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 bum. Perp Girl says, I don't think I'll be visiting your store. <laughs> what a shame. <laughs> you know how much I like <laughs> people coming by. <laughs> but if you do want to come on down, we're in Voorhees, New Jersey, in the Voorhees Memorial Shopping Center. All right, Spark Man, Needle Man, Gemini Man, and Shadow Man. Uh, what do you say I go for first? This is the part of the game that I always forget about. <sighs> do I sell peanuts? No. Mr. Wolverine 0085, thank you very much for the sub. Howdy as well. Mike, if you're a hardcore player, do you watch playthroughs? Um, I'm not a hardcore player. I'm a filthy, filthy casual. Last night I was playing a regular Mario. I, I'm as casual as I can get. Do I sell souls? We do! Uh, we, we uh, in fact, besides video games, uh, I thank you so much for bringing that, that up, by the way. People always are just there to get, you know, Nintendo games and Mario Kart, Mario Party, and whatever, and, you know, all that stuff. We sell human souls, and they're, we have the best deals on human souls that you can get. So, come on down. All right, so, let me start with Gemini Man. Am I gonna finish Mega Man Pico? Uh, didn't I? 
I don't remember. Uh, oh no, and then I had to like fix the controls or something. I actually don't remember. And then I did another stream with Aaron, and we played Pico. Uh, I don't remember. I, I honestly, I don't remember what happened with that. I think I, all I remember is having trouble with the controls or something with the fucking sticky keys, right? Is that it? But yeah, I, I'll, I'll do another Pico stream some sometime. That's always fun. And, ooh, that was quite the jump. Let me go. Aww. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. These, these guys are hilarious. Shoot above you then. How could I get that then? Magnet? I wanna get, I wanna, how do I get that, that thing up there? Maybe, yeah, I have to like be able to shoot up at some point here, don't I? With Shadow Man, no, not with Shadow Man, look. Look, it goes through the shit. Coil? Oh, okay, so with the rush, you, you can maybe do it. Alright, so I guess I gotta like go over here and then. What if I do rush jet? Does it fly like. It, oh, it actually flies well here. There you go, this is how you do it. Fuckers. There. Is worth it. Yes, Christian Slater. What about Christian Slater? Yes, yeah, so let's all talk about Christian Slater now. <laughs> but why are we talking about Christian Slater? Where is Piss Man? Where is Piss on me, beat me, 69? Why aren't all, all my regulars here? You motherfuckers want Mega Man, here's fucking Mega Man. Where the fuck are you? Where is Piss on me? Come on, Piss on me. You're letting us down. Watch, he's here. Cubius. All right, let's see. Uh-oh, fuck. See, now I don't know what to do. Oh, God. That's pretty good, actually. Oh, God. <clears throat> oh, my God. What's up, Dark Fielder? Ooh, yeah! Oh, 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 ho, 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 ho. It's like Batman farm time. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah! Yeah! <laughs> What's 
What's the Kool-Aid man doing today? Where has he been? Nobody has been talking about the Kool-Aid man the last few days. I would like to know what he's up to. You know what he's up to? He's bursting through the walls of <laughs> private individuals in their homes. Just like a family, just eat, sitting at home, eating their TV dinners, whatever, watching Sunday Night Football. And all of a sudden, a giant jug of juice slams through the wall, screaming in their face. That's a good advertisement for a product. Yeah! This is fucking terrifying. This should be a horror movie. Flavored water or whatever. Shit, 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 pickles. Fuck! Motherfuckers. Mm -hmm. But we got all those extra lives now, so did it matter? No, it didn't matter. I will still be the greatest hero of all time. God damn it. If there doesn't want to be a delay on this fucking thing. This is very, um, you know when too, an too many enemies get on the screen and then it gets, uh, like laggy, like the game does? Like the game gets kind of like laggy and stuff, uh... cool slowdown on Genesis. That's because Genesis does what Nintendo don't. All right, here we go. Uh, see, it's like with these, let's just try different things. Let's see, let's see what Neil does. All right, it's not terrible. No, okay, not Magnet. Should. Gemini, I don't know. No. Thank you, Servo Box. OG for gifting a sub to Miss Lucy08. Thank you very much, Turbo Box. If you're not ca careful, it will blast your ass. Shuriken pops bubbles. It all makes sense now. All right, so we got Spark Man, Needle Man, and Shadow Man left. Cookie Sandwich? Cookie Sandwich? Are you eating a cookie sandwich? Big Floppy Luigi? If you're cleaning your butt brutally, you're not doing it right. Yeah, uh, we should change. Brutal but clean needs to change your name to uh, daintily, da dainty butt clean. But it's clean. Soft butt clean. There you go. Soft, soft butt clean. Soft but clean. So if you ever, you know, anything happens to your account or you make a new one, soft but clean. Or something along those lines. <laughs> Alright, anyway. Uh, I don't know. Let's do Spark Man. Thanks, Jimmy Dune. Doom. I can't speak. Going up. 
Wipe it till it bleeds. Says Romham fifty six. You like how I literally read out pretty much any chat comment? This is like no discretion. So, some streamers would see, see some of these comments and they would just gloss over them. I'm like, oh yeah, rub it till it, rub your asshole till it bleeds. Yeah, let's let's let me read that comment out. You saw that movie Pan and thought you'd be you thought it'd be stupid, but that shit was fucking lit. <laughs> oh yeah, Pan, huh? And that, that, uh, yeah? That was good, that was good for you. He's like, yo, that pan shit? Shit's fucking lit. <laughs> Alright, Metal Blade time. Oh my god, I'm gonna get my ass handed to me. Alright, let's see what we can do. Uh, we got a needle, a magnet, I'll try a magnet. Eh, that's not bad. That ain't too bad. I might have guessed right. I think I guessed right. Oh, oh, yeah, metal and magnet. Like, that makes sense. Actually. Use your brain. That's the one indeed. Yeah, I got lucky that I picked that, honestly. Right, here we go. This is like some Mega Man 2 shit right here. Look at that. That's a fucking copy of Mega Man 2. So that's a that's what we call a throwback here on Mike Matei Live. Zoop, zoop. You know, I feel like I should do someday. I should go game by game and like make a comprehensive list of like which games I like better and how like how many I don't know how I'd make the list exactly, but how many games I like on Sega Genesis and how many games I really like on Super Nintendo and tally them up because I mean I'm starting I'm starting to find and feel like I I think I feel like there's more shit on Sega Genesis that I play than Super Nintendo. But I'm, but then again, I'm not sure. I, I feel like I need to make a more like I need to make my own like Super Nintendo version Genesis like thing. Something that's comprehensive where I actually go through and like play or make a list or something of like everything. Because I think I've been playing more um, Sega Genesis than than Super Nintendo. Um. I'm not done with that argument personally. J J James is, you know, he made his video. He's a Super Nintendo guy, but I, I have not made up my mind. I'm still, uh, I'm still. Uh, see, I, I'm like, uh, um, it's a for me that's a very hard question to answer because I don't. I feel like you can't really answer it until you've really, really played and given a chance to like everything that you know the systems have to offer it's like not f fair to not be to not know all the games you know because then you're leaving so many like th things out um so i don't know i've been playing so much stuff on you know uh genesis lately that i love i don't know You could play Yoshi's Island. I have played Yoshi's Island. Yoshi's Island is cool. Have you played Alien Soldier in Genesis? Uh, I have. Uh, not, I haven't streamed it. That's a, that's, a, that's a hard game, but I have played it. That's it's pretty cool. It depends on the genres that you like: Super Nintendo RPGs and side scrollers, Genesis sports and shooters. Uh, yeah, well. 
I don't know about that necessarily, but I mean Genesis, I would yeah, has the sports, but um, but Genesis definitely has the shooters. And that's the thing, like I I really like shooters are like the genre that I really like, so like I'm definitely like lean a little more towards Genesis there. And um, I mean I like RPGs, but I don't play as, as much of them. But I mean, so. Um, Genesis has crazy bus. Genesis wins. Oh, there you go. Actually, I never thought of it that way. Genesis has crazy bus. Fuck. That we just settled the argument. After all this time. There's no debate to that. Okay, Genesis is better than... We just settled it. Thank you. Who, who said that? Uh... Indie dev guy just settled the argument once and for all. He figured it out, guys. After all this time, we have a, we have like a definitive, definitive answer. It's, uh, it's Genesis. I never thought that we'd have a definitive answer. Oh my God! You know what? I just thought of something. I want to I want to bring something to the debate too. Uh, I hate to say this, also Super Nintendo fans, but. Sega Genesis also had that Gummy Bears game. You guys remember that Gummy Bears game? So it's like, if Crazy Bus isn't enough for you, and, and it really, it is, on top of that, Gummy Bears. So like, that's it, it's done. Argument over. I, I, I need to make no spreadsheet now. Thank you for saving me the work. This is like, oh, fuck, pause it, pause it, pause it, pause it, pause it, pause it. I can't pause when the laser beam's going. This guy sucks. Two lives, I'll, I'll do it. Is there another fucking thing to hit this guy with? Like, it's just taking it's taking away so much energy though. It's just like, all right, now I'm like I'm like almost I can get one more shot in with it. Fuck. Oh my god. Fuck. Fuck. I don't want to do it again. So here. I know. I know. Here. There was probably a, good, a better thing to use against him than that, but it was taking away a lot of energy, so. Anybody know what, what's better to use against that guy than that, than that? I mean, it was taking away a good amount of energy, but definitely there's probably something better. All right, Needle Man. According to the internet, Gemini Laser is the best. Okay, well, I mean, that's what it's using. You know, this enemy right here is a real prick. <laughs> I'm an asshole. Do I like shooters on Neo Geo or Genesis better? Ah, uh, boy. Uh, you know what? Ask me that question in a year from now. That's that's a that's a question that's I, I need I need to think about. It's a very good question though. See, both have so many and so many good ones. I think I feel like Genesis might as probably has more. I think it probably definitely has more. So, um, so that's that's hard though because there's some really quality ones on you know you know Geo. So I don't know. It's a very hard question. Aaron plays is on now too. Aerial Fighters 2 is bomb as fuck. Do -do -do -do. Here we go. Will it get me up? What? 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 Pulse Star is amazing. 
and your blazing star. Ah, thank you, Alraz. All right, airman time. All right, what have we not used? Let's see. I used magnet. I used needle. I think top. Gemini. We just used Gemini. Let's not do that. Snake. Spark. Maybe spark. Let's try spark. Let's see how that does. It's not too bad, actually. Not too bad. Pretty good. I'm getting lucky. Why doesn't Mega Man have a pet? Uh, cartoon, are you trying to say? A pet cartoon? What? Cartoon, cartoon! Slow down. Last night I was streaming the Super Mario Brothers games, and I uh, it was cool. We killed Bowser with the Hammer Bros. It's kind of cool. I hadn't done that before. Usually I knock him through the bricks or whatever. for me to finish Mega Man X7? We'll see. I mean, I beat Superman 64. Maybe I'll do that someday. See how much pain I want to put myself through? That game gets real tough at the end. I believe it. I believe it. Probably annoying as shit. Cause the whole rest of it is. Out of the ground. Bowser's own henchmen turned against him. What, because you get the hammer bro suit? <laughs> um, alright, so we, we got Crash Man here, let's see. Uh, la, 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 la. I don't know, hard? Let's try hard. Fuck. Hey! That works really well. Hit him. Ah. I got lucky on most of the pecking. Except for a couple of them. I just sort of process of elimination. I was like, what have I not used yet? All right. Uh, oh, yeah, we still got to do this. Wasn't there an X8? I believe so. I think I have it. Um, I haven't played it. I think I, I think it's PS2. I think I have it. 
Last X game was good finale. Which which is uh, that's which is X7, right? Isn't it X or I'm sorry, X8. Isn't X8 the last of the X's? The X X's is, is? I wanna do it this way. There's so much slowdown on this part. There you go. You can, like double jump. X8 is meh. I would uh, I wouldn't be surprised. Let's get this thing off the screen. Oh my god. You know what? No. Nope, we're not we're not playing that game. We don't play that. things. Yeah, uh, yeah, that's true. Alright, who do we got here? Woodman. You would think the, the blade would cut him, right? But let's say, uh, Neil Gemini, hard top. I don't know if the top yet. Snake, maybe? Snake, needle. Let's see needle. Needle's pretty good. Needle's pretty good. Shit. Have I done? Okay. So I think I think I have not used snake or top yet on these guys. So I'm probably gonna try snake on the whoever is left here. Who do we think is left? Um, we did Airman, Metal Man, Crash Man, Bubble Man. Did we do the Heat guy? Fuck, I don't remember. I don't think we've done Heat. We got Lava in the background, so. Man, I don't have any ice to fight him with. So. That's magma. Oh, sorry. It's not. It's magma. Magma. Let's get it right, please. Thank you, magma. Liquid hot. Fuck. All right. Um. Fill up some of these things. Fill up brush out, I guess. You know, like how every city has at least one factory filled with magma at least one so let's see we uh so if heat is coming up okay so i used this I, i've used that i mean I, maybe you can use things more than once i'm gonna maybe it's top or snake i feel like i didn't do snake so i'm gonna try snake i guess do 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 Or should I try to get, you know what, I have three lives. This is a good point to put in top man and see if it works. Do, do. Since I have like almost no life left. This is a test now. Shit. Uh, okay, so it took away like a fourth or whatever of the energy, so that's not bad. Okay. Use Piss Man, that did something, it did. Yeah, people were saying the top doesn't do anything. Look at this, look at this about top doesn't do anything. Let's see if I can prove everyone wrong here. <laughs> T 
Top Man, whole way through. Look at that. Top Man doesn't do anything. Break Man. It's Break Man, everybody. Here it comes, watch this, watch this. Crazy shit. Engage. I missed the... Alright, so we made it all the way up to Wily's castle. I'm gonna take a quick break, guys. I'll come back and we'll delve into Dr. Wily's castle. Be back in just a minute or two.
<laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back, and we are playing Mega Man 3, which we have a we have some Mega Man posters right here that you can see. I don't need the guys to see the other one. Let's see if we can do this. There you go. Check out that poster. So this is the German Mega Man poster, which I really like this one a lot. I think this is some of the best, like, NES era Mega Man art um, that there was. But that's Mega Man 2. This is also Mega Man 2. So this is both Mega Man 2. The Mega Man 3 one. Did I have that up? Um, <laughs> probably have it up somewhere. I don't see it. I don't know. I have it somewhere. Anyway, there is the Mega Man 3 one, but speaking of Mega Man 3. There's also this. Here's the Mega Man 3 Nintendo Power issue. He's looking fantastic on this issue, by the way. Check out, check out this, check out that jawline. Look at Mega Man's jawline. That, this is, this is, the guys, this is what you want to go for with your jaw. When you're working, when you're working your jaw out, you try to get, try to get it to look like that. Go for that. Um, let's see what they say about Mega Man 3. They have maps of the stages. All that good stuff that they always have. But where are we at here? Quick man. Wood man. Heat man. This is all the stuff I just did. Does it go into Wily's fortress? Oh, well. A little bit. Not much. So they only show a picture of the fortress and they, they talk a little bit about what's coming up. This is all there is though. Uh, the final round. Work your way to the mysterious skull. There's gonna be another yellow devil coming up. Basically they just give a stage overview but they don't really go much into, into detail about anything. There's an, there's an interesting article here. Let's start at the beginning. Computers like the NES control deck are impressive machines. You can do everything with them from designing spacecraft to rescuing Princess Toadstool from the evil clutches of King Koopa. But even the most powerful supercomputers are useless without programs to run them on. Game packs, of course, are really just programs that, control, that your control deck can run. So basically they're saying you can play your games on your Nintendo. <laughs> um, shameless self-promotion. As you know, programs consist of stored bits of data or memory in the form of numbers. What you might not know is how that memory card is stored in your game packs or that different games you use different types of components. What's the differences? Because the NES was designed so that the latest technology could be used in each new generation of game packs, it's like an RC car. When, the, when a faster motor comes out, you buy one and slap it on your old racer. That's how games can get bigger and better while your control deck stays the same. In 1985, the first NES games appeared using the NROM. ROM, which stands for read-only memory, is like a book with words that can't be changed or added to. By today's standards, the two microchips for the, com for the program and one for the characters were rather small. And this goes, this goes on and on and on and on. I'm not going to read the whole thing, but cool little article. See, they actually tried to give out some tech info here. It's not just all fun and games in Nintendo Power. 
That's that's cool that they did that. Actually, this goes on for pages. There's a whole big whole big spread on on that. That's that's kind of cool. Look at this. They have a whole thing on the immortal. Look, look if, if I ever go through it, I'll have to use this. Anyway, um, oh wait, classified information. You can get a 20 up in Dragon Spirit on NES. On controller two, press B, up, up, B, down, down, and B again. If you prefer to start from the beginning, you can load up with 20 dragons. After the first battle, whether you win or lose, the title screen will appear. At that time, press and hold the A and B buttons on controller two and press start on the control on controller one. When the adventure begins, you will have 20 dragons in reserve. That's cool. Thunderbirds for NES. Deja Vu. I'm a Shadowgate guy, not so much Deja Vu. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Oh, here's the poster. Check out the poster. Now I've already I've already played through this game on stream. Um more than, more than once. I actually have another copy of the poster on the wall over there. That's one of my favorite Nintendo Power posters. This one I need to do. I haven't gotten to this yet. Gremlins 2? Well, I will do this eventually. I, pr I promise. One of these days we'll do Gremlins 2. The whole game. This is cool. To, I should remember this is the issue for it. See? Many more streams to come. We're not done yet, folks. Many more streams and many more stream ideas. This is why you guys gotta stick around, keep coming back. Look at look at him. Look at him. Doing his dance. Look at this fucking guy. And sorry, I'll get back to Mega Man in a second. Look at this fucking dude. I can't like <laughs> Looks like the creature from Black Lagoon. Oh, this is they, they, they have a really good section on this. I'll have to actually read that when, when I do that. I probably won't remember. Dragon's Lair. Oh my god, it's the Dragon's Lair Game Boy game. I told you the story about how the guy sent me a big email. So I, I did a stream playing some Game Boy games one time. I get to Dragon's Lair because I played like, you know, the Nintendo game. So I played the Game Boy game, which is different than the NES game. And played it for, I don't know, 20 minutes or something. I, try, I tried it. I tried playing it, and uh, it didn't do too great, and I got killed by spikes and, or something like that. I checked my email a few days later, a week later, whenever, and this guy sends me, like, the most comprehensive, like, uh, information about Dragon's Lair on Game Boy. I should go back and I should go back and find that email and read it to you guys because that guy must have been the world master on Game Boy Dragon's Lair. Which hey, you know what? Everybody's got their thing. Howard and Nestor. Sorry, now I'm just looking at this Nintendo Power. This is the cool issue. Crystalis. Oh! And then, um, I made an appearance one time in Nintendo Power. Here's the time I made the appearance. I'm right there. There I am. With Mario. Mario's here. I'm here. You didn't know Mario was that small, did you? You could, you could fit Mario on your tongue. Um, whole cool thing on Mario, Mario World Famicom Showcase. Such a good magazine. This is a good issue here. A little F-Zero thing, Pilot Wings. We're talking about the Super Nintendo on the way. 
uninvited. Anyway. Oh. And what could you get out of the vending machine? Look at the shit you can get out of the, the vending machine. The, uh, the satellite thing. I had that around somewhere. That might be in Aaron's room. Um, a Zelda puzzle. I used to have that puzzle. Just a regular Nintendo hat. Punch out hat, that's cool. Zelda clock, I see that clock at convention sometimes. Goes for a few hundred dollars now, I think. Uh, the, the lunchbox, I have that lunchbox. That, that you can get pretty easily. NES Max controller, which I don't like. And Super Mario Brothers 3, which we played last night. There's your issue of Mega Man 3. All right, let's get back to this. We're on Dr. Wily's castle, folks. This is Mega Man 3. That NES Monopoly is pretty good. I really like NES Monopoly. Um, it's very fast moving. A lot of people don't like to play Monopoly because they don't like to clean it up and it takes a really long time. Play NES Monopoly and once you you know play play through like once you get used to it, it's very fast paced and I think that's the best way to play Monopoly, like period. There's a lot of Monopoly games on PC. Usually all those have like these animations that come in. You gotta wait for the fucking dog to go down the street and all this shit. NES game is like fast. It's good. Alright. So yeah. So if you do if you are a person that likes Monopoly and you have not played the NES Monopoly, I, I definitely actually really suggest highly suggest it. Like I'm not kidding right now. Sometimes I'm Joking? I'm not kidding. It's good. It's really good. What was I? Was I in the wizard? Um, yeah, that wasn't Fred Savage, that was me. Alright, uh, is it hard man on this? Yeah. Fred Savage's stunt double? No, he was my stunt double. I was the star. He did all the dangerous stunts. We had him jump off of a mountain one time. Lucky, lucky he survived that fall. Did I ever play Frogger for PC? I mean, like, wasn't there probably like a lot of versions of Frogger on PC? I would imagine. Uh, but yeah, I probably, I probably have. I feel like I've played a lot of different versions of Frogger. Oh, this 
things? Am I supposed to just kill the turtle shells or? This is convenient because I can go fuck up. Ooh. Just heard my NES controller crack. Up. Oh, that was it? The fuck? Okay. The fuck was that? How did that how did that go by so easily? <laughs> that was like the easiest boss I ever fought in my entire fucking life. Four lives. Should I go get it? Fuck it, I guess I'll go get it. We can take this a second and go get it. Maybe my controller's made out of pork rinds. Hey, your controller's made out of pork rinds. It's a pretty good comeback, huh? Been working on that one. Oh my god! No, you don't get to do that, Mr. Bug. I don't think so. Uh-uh. In AAA games, developers uh, asset flipping and developing games in a single month and releasing them as $60 games. Do you see any? Do you see a correlation between now and games like Mega Man and that generation getting the same game over and over again? Does that bother anyone? Do you mean because like? It will like look at like I'm gonna mean like there's like Assassin's Creed. Um, if I'm understanding your co correction uh, correctly, where you're saying like it's like the first game has the initial work where they put the money into it, but then they get more out of it by releasing all these sequels. So it's like they come up with the initial idea for like let's say Mega Man, and then they make sequel after sequel after sequel as long as people like it. Where like it's like Assassin's Creed, they come up with something pretty successful and then keep like keep just sort of like adding to it to save costs? Is that what you're trying to say? I, feel, I might have your, might be getting your question a little bit uh, discombobulated, I think. Discombobulated. Are you winning, Mike? Uh, I'm trying to do the winning. I will, I, I do it. I do it. I do it. Mike, let me answer the question. And then he just put a bunch of mo money emotes in the chat. What are you, you Scrooge McDuck over here? Oh shit, all right, this is Yellow Devil time, huh? All right. Because I'm gonna die, so I'll see if I, how far I can get with just this. Then again, how much of this do you think it takes away if I shoot one? Oh, oh, oh! What? I didn't even fucking see anything. It was like the it was the flashing. Like, oh my god, I gotta walk through the whole thing again. Fuck me.
they're screaming cheat at me. Uh, I mean, uh, can you use the pause thing on this? I thought that was only Mega Man 1. I've never done it in 3. No, the game has cheating. Wait, 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 wait. How? Oh, 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 oh. Because I couldn't see the thing on the screen. I see. Okay. Yeah. That. Yeah, it was cheap. Fuck. Oh no. I'm gonna die. Damn it. No pause trick in three. Yeah, I didn't think so. I was gonna say. I was actually gonna say if there if there was a pause trick in three, in this one, uh, I wanted to try to do it because <laughs> I've never done that. I only did it in the first one. Because hey, I, I learned something new yesterday with Mario three. So I mean, hell, you know, you never know. I could be learning things still with all these games. Broom Hatter. This guy in particular? Yeah, fuck him. <laughs> fuck him in particular. I guess, uh, let's check this side. It's probably, I probably won't be going up on the other side, right? Yeah. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I like this music on this stage. Wily's overcompensating in this game with the tower. It's it's a bit much. Yeah, 
why doesn't Dr. Wily just drop a bomb on Dr. Light? Because he's like the one fucking like making all these robots and giving Mega Man all his equipment. He should, like, Dr. Wily should just fucking kill Dr. Light. Don't go, for, don't go after Mega Man, go after Dr. Light. He's not that smart of a scientist after all. Dr. Wily, I'm talking about, he's not that smart. Because if he was smart, he would fucking take out Dr. Light. And then Mega Man wouldn't have all the shit. Or he could have taken him out in the first place before he even built Mega Man. Dr. Wily's an idiot. He does, he, Dr. Wily deserves to die because he's a, he's a bad uh, fucking villain because he's fucking stupid. But plot, lol. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but plot. Do -do -do -do. And that's it. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh my god, set me back this far? It's not gonna keep me like right there? Fuck you, game. Zelda 2 sword level 1 challenge. Oh, don't upgrade the sword? I'm gonna write that down. That's a, not a bad idea. I wrote it down. That's a good idea. I don't think I ever thought to do that. That's brutal, lol. One sword. Yeah, level the level one sword. Yeah, I mean, that would be pretty horrible. But, uh, I don't know. I might, I might, I don't, I might try it. We'll see, we'll see. I, I've done crazier things, probably. But clean, yeah. Yeah, any reason to do it, right? 400 hits on Thunderbird? <laughs> yeah, right? I don't know. I have no idea what that would be like. Beat TMNT with the Rolling Rocker? I want to do it with a one-handed controller. We got the boss gauntlet, boss rush, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Maybe since it's Mega Man, we should call it Rush, huh? Because, you know. <laughs> fuck. Um, let me use this first. Oh my god, I don't need a button. Actually, can you do like magnet on magnet? Let's see.
So weird that the first hit always takes less damage. I know. I, I was thinking about that earlier in the stream. Wrong thing on. Fucked up. Fucked up. Fucked up. Fuck you, motherfucker. What if I use hard man on hard man on hard man? Well, the other thing I was using was magnet on him, wasn't it? I don't have much left of that. Let's try hard on hard. Oh no, long, long way. Oh my god. Ah. Got, I got hard on hard, man. <laughs> it's pretty hard. It's getting really hard. Top on top? Should we try top on top? Hop on pop? Eh. What was I using on him? Wasn't it hard actually on him too? Damn it. Jim. Thank you, Thomas ZW87 for the tier one sub. Shadow Man. <laughs> Fuck you, Shadow Man. Now I don't know who's left. Wanna be metal blade. <laughs> boom, boom, ba boom, ba boom. Alright, what, what have we not used yet? The spark thing, right? Which was on. I, I think this is gonna be for spark, right? Let me try this on him. Does that work on him? No. Snake on snake. Snake, snake, snake. Needle or that, yeah. Oh, needle works on him too? Is there anybody left? Oh, we got through this. Okay. We're getting there. Let me make sure that I have the top spin. We need a little top spin, I know that for sure. Um, fell apart a little bit. Rush yet? Hard. Let's get really hard here. It's so hard. It's getting so hard now. Crispy Shark for the sub. Told you it was getting hard. And Psychotic Cock. Thank you very much, Crispy Shark, for the three months sub. And also three months uh, to Psychotic Cock. Thank you, Psychotic Cock. 
He sat on me. Alright, let's get out the spark shot thingy. Wily's fucking teabagging Mega Man here. You want some fucking tea bag, Mega Man? Motherfucker? Oh, you can just shoot through the thing. I didn't realize that. Okay. Well, I'm stupid. Now. Now. Um. How am I gonna get up to him? Is there a coil, maybe? Fuck. Oh, he drops down. Fuck, okay. be a better way. Fuck. Alright, well that's not good. Now I don't have the fucking spark left to it. Oh no, I do have some spark. Alright. Working. Fucking these things don't work. I mean, they work barely. I'm gonna get fucking crushed now. Fucking weak. Jesus. Da -da -da. I feel like um, 
the shadow. Like, I don't know. I feel like that's not really the way to go with that. There's got to be a better way, a better weapon for that. Thank you, Crispy Shark. So if he didn't have the shadow, you couldn't beat him, I guess, huh? Because there's nothing else that really shoots up like that. That first part of that, is there anything else besides shadow that you can use? Hey, thanks, Duo, for gifting out subs to the community, to Dunkle Sloth, Berg, DK81, Good Kid Mad, Billy Furious, and Joe Franiac. If you guys got a gift sub, please say thank you to Duo. Crispy for gifting a tier one sub to Dank420 Bong Hits. Dank420 Bong Hits. Lekman, there goes Lekman. Thank you, Test24, for subbing with Twitch Prime. Bomb Man. Bomb Man. Good job, by the way, if you hit the top spin too late, it will waste ammo for it. Hmm. Thank you, Illusioner. Thank you, guys. We got a lot of uh, Proto Man in the chat. Thank you, Test24, for subbing with Twitch Prime. If you guys have Amazon Prime, you can sub for free. Appreciate the support. We Mike Boogies. In this thing. I don't think they have a mail section in this one. They have an article on new kids on the block, though. Most importantly, Danny Wahlberg. So I'm gonna look at the top 30 games now. Let's see how much bullshit it is in this issue. They list Mario 3 as the first game. Okay, so, okay. 
So here we go. They're saying uh, the 10th game here. Just, I'll get a quick shot of this. Back to the Future, they're saying, is the 10th best game. So they're saying uh, Back to the Future. Oh, number 15 is Batman for NES. So they're saying that Back to the Future on NES is better than Batman for NES. Okay, good job, Nintendo Power. Super C, they are listed as number 20. Lolo, they have it fucking 23. Yeah. Zelda 2 The Adventure Link at 17. Yeah, sure. Back to the Future is a lot, a lot better than Batman Zelda 2. Castlevania 3 they have it at 21. This is bullshit. Bullshit. But Mega Man 3 is not bullshit. Mega Man 3 to this day is an awesome game for the Nintendo Entertainment System. I still enjoy it. Excellent game. Top notch. And you even beat the final boss with the top weapon. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Uh, I'll be back soon with some more retro games, some more new games, all that good stuff. Thanks for the subs and all that. Thanks for the support. And I will see you guys later. Bye.